Hi, I'm Kristen with the Crescent City Classic, and as we gear up for our 10K in April, we are so excited to bring you behind the scenes of two of our charities that we have this year, the Split Second Foundation and Team Gleason. So this is the Split Second Fitness Center. It was Mark Raymond's dream about two years ago, and here we are. He's directly fulfilling a need of our community, and we are so excited to be a part of that with the Run For program. This is the first intentional recovery-based exercise facility in the state of Louisiana specifically for people with different disabilities such as strokes or paralysis from stroke, uh, different neurological conditions and amputations. Split Second Foundation's mission is to break barriers for people with disabilities. I started training for the Crescent City Classic on this guy in December, so I hope I got a good enough head start. So all of this started with my personal experience navigating the healthcare system and inevitably feeling isolated and um, left to fend for myself. Being a charity partner for the Crescent City Classic the last four years has been amazing. and It's become one of our best fundraisers just because of the fun nature of it, right? Uh, I think so many people in the city already look forward to it. Like a week after I did my first Crescent City Classic and saw that they had a charity component and light bulbs went off. We raised almost $30,000 which gave us seed funding to purchase equipment and inevitably find the space to open our first facility. The Crescent City Classic has been an integral part of our success and we are grateful to have their support in here. So we're here at Team Gleason headquarters where all the magic happens and that's where they help ALS patients every single day in every single state. So let's go see what they're doing. The Run Forward program, the Crescent City Classic, has made such an impact uh, not just on the overall community of New Orleans but on Team Gleason specifically. Um, it creates such a unique way for people to get involved that may not be able to do it in traditional terms. We have raised over $400,000 for Team Gleason for people with ALS directly impacted um, because of this program. So many people don't know the full scope of what Team Gleason has become and, and grown into. We help people in all 50 states now. We're working with partners like Google and Microsoft. The technology that we are helping uh, people with ALS with, so much of it is not covered by insurance. And that's why there's such a big need for them and a need for Team Gleason to support those. My name is Roger. I've been diagnosed with ALS bulbar with the average life expectancy of two and a half years after diagnosis. I've recently passed the two year mark. I'm glad to meet you. My experience with Team Gleason has been awesome. My life has been greatly enhanced through Team Gleason. Let's kick ALS in the ass together. No white flags. We've uh, impacted people with ALS directly because of the funds that we've been able to raise with this program in the Crescent City Classic. So it's been instrumental to uh, what we do. And um, so we, we wouldn't, can't imagine anything without it. And, and it connects us with the community, which is so, so impactful right. um, and something that uh, we want to continue to do. It's not just about um, asking people for donations. This is an, a, a program that directly puts us in touch and connections with people, which is so important.